Bubble sort is a sorting algorithm that runs in quadratic time. The benefit of bubble sort is that it is very easy to implement and understand. However, the downside of bubble sort is that it can perform slower on large lists compared to other sorting algorithms. The basic idea of bubble sort is to loop through a list and compare each element to the next element in the list. If the current element is greater than the next element, then we need to swap the two elements. We then continue looping through the list, making comparisons and swaps until there are no swaps left to make. When there are no swaps left to make, the list is sorted. So let's look at an example. Suppose we have a list of five numbers, 9, 11, 3, 15, and 6. In the first iteration of our loop, we compare 9 to 11. 9 is less than 11, so we simply move to the next element. Next, 11 is greater than 3, so we swap them. Next, 11 is less than 15, so we move to the next element. And finally, 15 is greater than 6, so we swap them. Because we made swaps during the previous iteration, we need to loop through the list again and examine it for additional swaps. So on the second iteration, 9 is greater than 3, so we swap them. 9 is less than 11, so we move to the next element. And 11 is greater than 6, so we swap them. 11 is less than 15, so we move to the last element, which is the end of the list. Once again, we made swaps during the previous iteration, so we need to loop through again and examine it for additional swaps. On the third iteration, 3 is less than 9, so we move to the next element. 9 is greater than 6, so we swap them. 9 is less than 11, so we move to the next element. 11 is less than 15, so we move to the next element, which is also the end of the list. And once again, because we made swaps during the previous iteration, we need to loop through the list again and examine it for additional swaps. On the fourth iteration, we discover that each element is less than the next element in the list and no swaps take place, which indicates that we finally have a sorted list. Lastly, here's how a bubble sort would look written in Java. Thank you for watching.